a lot of times people want to know how much it was true, you know, because there's drug dealing and there's many voices in the book, but I mean, nonetheless, when they're looking at the conductor, they just want to know like, where was your, where was your source material from? And uh, I told people I took templates from things that I was aware of, you know, situations that I know, people that I know like that. Um, but <clears throat> I'd say more of the family stuff was kind of close to the bone opposed to the street stuff because, you know, if you know much about the streets, you know, if that's a lifestyle that you want to disengage from, you ought to leave it alone. Well, I'd say the first time that I was asked during a Q&A what my writing process was, I almost laughed because it took me seven years to complete writing this book. And so over the seven year period, I've been a million different people. You know, I was playing college basketball. I was doing all kinds of stuff. And so there were times that I was writing on the bus after games. There were times I was writing on the way to games. Uh, but I think now that I've settled down, I've come out to Iowa, I prefer to write. And I can't really have anybody around. It just is distracting. I, get like a weird complex with people looking over my shoulder. Him and I became very close because the summer after I got here, I was a full fellow my first year, so I was teaching a summer class over the summer, and we taught on the same day, and so we would hang out a lot, and we'd go back to his house and hang out, and uh, he really, I think, gave me some awesome advice during critical periods where there was a time that after my first year, we went out to New York and I shopped a partial of my novel and I did end up having somebody trying to put an offer on it and he had given me some advice about how it was going to go out there. And he was just kind of like, let me tell you how they're going to come at you. And I kind of came back from the trip, just like, you're crazy, like, who are you? Like, what do you know? <laughs> oh yeah, it's very kindred, I think. Um, on a base level, effort and trying will only guarantee you a chance. That's it. You know, like in basketball, they can promise you if you don't work hard that you're not going to be very good. But if you work hard, that guarantees you a chance. It doesn't guarantee it's going to work out. Go to the basketball court. <laughs> it's kind of funny. I found writing through having an extreme disaffection with basketball. It was not going how I wanted it to go. A lot of times I'll be shooting around, like have a thought, and like by the end of like a shooting session, I have like ten notes worth of things, and then I can come home and actually start to formulate them there. Because sometimes when you just go sit at the computer, the blank screen, it's just kind of like I don't know what to do to you. I feel like there's no way I would achieve writing if I worked the way like a copy editing team worked. Where like, I feel like you just like release these savage hounds loose and like they will find every piece of anything that is hidden in this manuscript. I do believe there's a spiritual aspect of it because I think when writing you're dealing with matters of the soul a lot. Um, and I don't know, I guess there must be a break in people that believe in souls and people that don't. Um, but I mean, I, I believe in souls, I believe in the spirit of a place, I believe in communal energy. Um, and I think that the energy that I bring to, the, to a, any given work environment is a part of it. You know, like while I was writing my book, I lost a couple friends. And I think that I mean, I know specifically where those sections are because the writing's a little darker. Um, and I think a lot of times, instead of shying away from the page, but using my emotions like in service of my writing is something that's usually helpful, you know. Anybody that writes is a writer. I think anybody that spends that amount of time intensely by themselves and deals with Everything that comes along with that. Mm -hmm.